सो ही गाइज वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल फॉर टूटोरियल सो गाइज टूडे आई टीच यू न्यू स्टाइल ऑफ क्रिएटिव प्रोडक्ट सी जी आई एनिमेशन विद यूजिंग आफ्टर इफेक्ट एंड ब्लेंडर सी गाइज दैट्स माई रियली कूल प्रोडक्ट एंड गाइज सेकेंड वन आई क्रिएट दिस वन प्लांट एंड ग्रास इफेक्ट दिस वन राइट ओके सो गाइज नाउ आई शो यू माई फाइनल रेंडर प्रिव्यू एंड गाइज गो टू ऑन आफ्टर इफेक्ट एंड प्रेस प्रिव्यू या सी गाइज दैट्स माई फाइनल वन it's looking really good okay so guys now i teach you how i create this type of effect and composition so guys stop and guys i create new composition check and guys again go to on here yeah okay so guys firstly select your all assets and press delete key delete and guys now go to on after effect and guys i create new composition check and guys composition duration 10 second is good for me and press okay so guys now go to our project import your clip guys i have clip so guys you can download this clip link in description and simple drag and drop on main com like this yeah and guys go to our tracking and track camera check yeah so guys see that's my detail analysis check okay so guys my tracking is finished now guys increase frame see guys that's my tracking points right okay so guys now go to on here and guys select your tracker points like this and guys select three points and now right click guys set ground plane and origin check and one more time right click set solid camera check yeah and guys preview check preview yeah that's my simple tracker and guys increase your this one tracker solid scale size like a uh, 300 enter yeah much better right and guys now one more time preview check okay so guys all is good and now guys this tracker import in blender so stop guys little bit change like a 250 yes good and one more time preview Okay so guys all is good and now guys go to on blender top and guys go to on first frame See guys that's my first second and third fourth guys select four option and copy go to on blender and guys see that's my ae blender add on so guys create plane check that's my plane and guys second one i take camera and camera check and guys camera position copy and guys camera check yeah okay see guys that's my camera and now guys increase this one so guys go to on here and guys select your camera start from one frame one frame and guys increase this one guys i like 300 is good for me i like 300 only and guys now go to on here one more time and guys see that's my camera and focal length copy so press control c and guys blender select your camera and focal length paste yeah that's it guys right okay so guys go to on background image check and guys import your same clip so import select and guys press zero for camera and opacity 100% yeah that's it see guys that's my simple plane and tracker right okay so guys now all is good so guys this time i apply two plane for five guys firstly i apply grass and second one shadow so guys go to on here and see guys that's my plane and guys plane increase increase and guys rotate your plane rotate like this yeah guys i increase more yeah and guys go to back guys take more yeah much better and guys play yes right see guys that's my simple plane and next one guys i apply second plane for shadow so guys select this plane and duplicate so press control c and v see guys that's my second plane and guys green in like a shadow yeah right and guys same increase scale size increase like this yeah see guys that's my scale size okay so guys go to on render setting and guys render setting i use cycle render 
and divide GPU check and go to one max and like a uh, two five six is good for me. But guys, you can take five one two and guys go to on here fill and see guys that's my transparency check and go to on color management and see guys that's my view transform I use standard yeah and guys go to on here guys select your shadow layer this one and click on here and visibility and shadow catcher check yeah that's it guys right okay so guys press zero and guys now all is good so guys next one height and guys next one I apply this time plants effect so guys select your plane and go to on here edit mode so guys select your all cultures select vertex and right click subdivision surface and subdivision like a 30 yeah see guys that's my vertex and guys now you can select randomly vertex so guys select this one randomly right so guys that's really simple yeah much better see guys that's my simple selection and guys next one click on here guys see that's my vertex group check and assign check guys i select this vertex and guys go to on object mode so guys this time go to on here that's my particle so guys now i apply some assets so guys i already download some assets so guys click on here see guys that's my asset browser and see guys that's my assets right guys it's biome reader add-on guys if you want this assets guys video link in description and guys now import your asset so guys go to on here and guys now i create new collection new collection and guys rename like a plant and guys import your assets like this yeah simple see guys that's my flower increase scale size like this and guys rotate yeah and guys i apply more plants simple drag and drop and guys see that's my different different style of grass and plants and increase scale size and guys you can apply different different style of plants like this yeah and guys i'll guys second one use grass see guys that's my grass and closer right and guys select your grass and increase scale size like this okay so guys now next one i apply some flowers so guys go to on here like this yeah increase and guys go to down red flower and increase a little bit yeah good so guys go to down and see guys that's my flower and apply yeah see guys that's my beautiful flowers and guys i like this one and guys select guys increase scale size like this yeah much better okay see guys that's my different different style of grass and now guys go to on here all is good and guys select this plane select and guys go to on here particles and guys apply particle check and here check yes and advanced check yeah see guys that's my particles here and guys firstly go to on here vertex group and see guys that's my land so click on here yeah and go to on render and see guys that's my render as use collection and guys see that's my collection so select plants yeah see guys that's a plant and increase scale size increase like this yeah see guys that's my plants right it's looking really good okay so guys all is good and now i will create scale size animation and guys see that's my number like a four thousand is good and guys now all is good so guys go to a render and see guys that's my scale random and guys i like one yeah see guys that's my size random and guys now you can change also scale size so guys select this plants so guys select all plants and little bit increase scale size 
like this and press zero for camera yeah that's my some effect so guys go to a timeline and guys preview check yeah see guys that's my simple plants and guys now i create plant growing animation so guys select your plane and guys click on here and scale size i like zero and one frame and animation check and guys now go to like a i take 100 frame guys scale size like a 0 0.8 yeah and press animation key yes and guys now select your keys and press t and brazier check yeah that's it and guys preview check and play yeah see guys that's my plant growing effect and guys now all is good yeah okay so guys my plant animation is finished now next one i apply product so guys for product i use this time guys go to our here sketch path add on and activate check and guys select here and guys search and type headphone enter yeah so guys click on here see guys that's my different different style of product guys you can apply simple drag and drop okay so guys now i already downloads this time product and guys import select headphone and guys append collection check yes and guys see that's my headphone so guys that's my this one drag and drop yeah see guys that's my headphone and guys this time increase scale size so guys select your headphone and increase scale size like this so up like this okay see guys that's my extra wire nice hide hide and hide dot radar yeah and guys now i create cam this time guys headphone rotation animation and guys go to on preview check and guys increase scale size like this yeah see guys that's my composition yeah much better and scale size little bit change little bit yeah good and guys now go to on here guys position change yeah this position is good right and little bit up little bit yes that's it guys okay so guys now i create position and camera rotation animation and guys go to on here position like a 15 is good 15 and camera position check and guys like a 100 frame and camera check and guys go to on up so out of frame like this like a 100 check yeah and guys preview yeah that's my simple position animation and next one guys i create rotation animation so guys camera uncheck and guys that's my rotation yeah that's my rotation okay so guys zero go to our first frame and check and go to on last like a 500 check yeah and guys preview so guys play yes see guys that's my really cool animation it's looking really beautiful right okay so guys now all is good guys my animation is finished now next one i apply some lighting and hdr image so guys go to on world and apply environment texture check and open guys i have hdr texture so select and import yeah and guys little bit change strength like a 0 0.8 is good and next one guys i apply light for light guys i use sunlight and up so guys go to on press 7 and go to on here that's my side light yeah press zero okay okay see guys that's my back light i don't like back apply on side here yeah i like this one and guys rotate rotate like this little bit yeah that's it okay so guys select your light and guys strength i like four and angle 20 and press zero and guys preview yeah good and guys click on here that's my render preview yeah okay so guys now so guys you can hide this plane this one 
I don't like this on plane. So guys, select this plane and go to on particle. So guys, see that smash show emitter uncheck. And guys, go to on render and click on here. So guys, I change render setting. Yeah, all is good. And guys, render and render image check. Guys, I show you only one frame render. Yeah, see guys, that's my beautiful color and beautiful render. Guys, after render, I create some composition. Okay, so guys, my render is finished now. Close and go to on composition. And guys, now firstly, I select movie clip. Movie clip. So guys, go to on top. And guys, next one. Select. And guys, I apply this time viewer. And last, I apply alpha over. And connect. So guys, this one, it means to connect first. And guys, second one, connect. And guys, click on here. Yeah, that's it. So guys, import your clip. So select movie clip. And same, apply clip like this. Yeah. And guys, press V. That's my composition. And guys, now, guys, see that's my with background and guys click on here okay so guys all is good that's my final work so guys you can change also this one strength and guys sunlight powers depending on your work that's my final work and guys click on here frame rate i use same frame rate 29.97 and end frame guys go to one desktop and create new folder and take any file name like this and guys format file i like png rgb alpha yeah that's it guys guys preview check yeah see guys that's my final work it's looking really beautiful guys now you can increase more particles this depend on your work so guys click on here particles and see guys that's my number you can increase and guys go to on here all is good and guys now again preview check yeah that's it guys Okay, so guys, my final work is finished now. Guys, go to an after effect and guys, import your clip, project, and right click import and import file. Guys, I already create render, so render and guys, import. So simple drag and drop and with 200% check. Guys, preview check. Yeah. See, guys, that's my final work. Right. Okay, so guys, that's it. My final work is finished. So guys, if you like my video, please share and please subscribe my YouTube channel. Thank you.